Hello! This is a very short video on how I use tags when incremental reading in SuperMemo. So this is just a text file here, tags, which I keep on my USB flash drive. The flash drive I also keep my SuperMemo collection on, and then when I'm done with SuperMemo I use SyncToy, a little program to just back up the flash drive, because I'm very paranoid about it um, losing my collection at some point. So Super Memo does not have a built-in tags feature. So I make little tags myself using the money sign. And I did read Waz, the creator of Super Memo, had an article somewhere that mentioned this because Super Memo does not have a real built-in tags feature like Evernote. But this actually, in a way, works even better. So um, in Vim, if there's a main topic, I will just do, for example, anything on the Middle Ages will be money sign medieval. Pretty self-explanatory. And then each capitalized new word is how I distinguish now a subtopic. So it's a kind of a hierarchy of tags. So the medieval economy is medieval economy. Pretty self-explanatory. So as I go through incremental reading, um, and I never remember where this stuff come from, comes from that pops up in my queue, but I put things in concepts and I put them in a quasi um, organized knowledge tree, sort of. But the most helpful thing to me is to put in a tag. So that way I can dismiss an item and just put in um, a tag and find anything that I want. So if I want uh, a big history dump, um, of all monarchs, I can just go the front of that word, search my whole collection, and it will pop up. But I also back up, I just copy and paste each topic before I dismiss it. So you can see these are all yellow, they're all dismissed. I will then put those into Evernote. Um, that way, what I like about this system is it keeps my incremental reading not too overwhelming. I have about 80,000 topics, but I only have 400 um, in play that are getting shuffled and reshown to me in incremental reading, and that's about more than enough. I don't really like going more than a few hundred. 400 is really too much. But with these kinds of tagging system, I can quickly you know, find any information I'm looking for, and I find it works pretty well. And Vim is nice because you can do things like sort you and it will automatically sort all your tags um, and I you know might make a little plugin or something using regex that will uh, better organize the tags since the only real rhyme or reason to my tags is each capital letter is now a new sub tag if that makes sense and um, you can see I've got 1441 at the moment so anyway this is a fun way of taking notes hope this is helpful